Welcome back, man, for you instructional video. What's going on? We're going to do a little wheel today, a little single speed wheel. But before we get into that, a little quick shout out. Quick shout out to my man, Fly Like I Do One. Fly Like I Do One is making fun of the man boobs, all right? I am built for comfort, okay? Comfort and power, not speed. You too, okay? If you work out and you do the right thing, can also have nice pictorial man boobs like me if you try. Love you haters. Love you trolls. You're always fun. I'm going to get away from that. Amp the Vaults. Amp the Vaults, another great guy. Uh, really special. He gave us a couple of really great comments. Uh, really appreciate it. Uh, great job. Thank you so much. 420 Torque, another ha special hello, and also Kenny Rogers one over there in New Zealand. How you doing? Back at you. 26 by 1.75 to 2.125 rear coaster brake single speed wheel. Here we have a beautiful but beat up simple single made by Giant, and the rear wheel is just ram 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 ram. This thing is. Let me get a picture from the get back a, here. Yeah, get a little, get, check out the back end of this thing. Holy cats, it's a wiggle wobble. It's a wiggle wobble big time. This thing is absolutely done, finished, kaput. Okay, Wait, so it hit by a go. car bike, man? I don't know what happened to it. So here you go. We have a nice brand new wheel. This is coming to you, okay, as you see it. We do take the plastic wrap off because, as usual, with all of the bike man's wheels, you get a brand new rubber rim strip which I'm installing. If you need for me to install the cog, just give me a note and I will. Well, I'm going to show you real quick here on what's going on with the cog and what it comes with after I get this darn rim strip on here. Line up the hole. Make sure you're covering all of those spoke nipples, guys, when you're doing this. You don't have to worry about it because you'll get it like this, but you, know, you never know. Somebody might have screwed it up. Get it nice and in the center. Okay, here we go. Comes with a little packet of parts. Looks like this. What's in that packet of parts? Some of the stuff you need, some of the stuff you don't need. Two axle nuts. You definitely need those. This is a new coaster brake thingy that would be wrapped around. Sorry for the back. This would wrap around here like this if you needed to. This one's already built in, so I don't have to worry about this for that. Okay, that's what this is for, if you don't know. And then you get a new bolt for that, for that uh, coaster brake strap, clamp, whatever it is. Now get onto the cog. You got a little dust cover ring thing that kind of goes on first. Straight on. Then comes your cog. This is a 18 tooth cog, kind of the normal. Gonna fit right onto there like that. Then we have this lock ring thing. Now, you guys might not have reverse pliers, but I have reverse pliers. You can just force it on there however it takes, okay? Me being a paid professional and I have every tool under the sun, I have what they call reverse pliers. Reverse pliers looks like this. And what I'm gonna do, it's got little grippers on there. I need 10 hands for this. Let me put that down here like that. There we go. Okay, so I've now set my reverse pliers inside of that little ring thing, getting it onto here, give it a little push out, oh, the boom, how smooth was that, right? Now, before you go any further with this, I would like for you to, just to make sure that the thing, the ring is seated inside of that hub, I'll be right back. Just to make sure it's seated in that thing, you can see the, the slit here, so start from the outside over on the other side and work your way this way. Just a little, little tap -a -roo. just to make sure it's in there good. And work your way over to the, again, starting from the edge and working your way in. You can see how she got in there a little bit better. You don't want that thing popping off of there. That could be a pain in the neck. Then your chain flops off and then you're stranded down there at the beach. Again, it's a single speed, 26 by 175 by 2.2. It's made, the rim is aluminum. 
made by Wyman. Hub is a, just a generic standard coaster brake hub. Got the hub there. Whoops, sorry. No markings on the hub. Maybe there is here. Here we go. It's a his top. Who knows? It's a decent quality hub. Coaster brake. Rear wheel for this beautiful, simple bicycle. So now I'm going to install the tire and whatnot. And of course, you know, you guys need to install the tire. You can go back and you can check it out. You know what it is. And uh, there you have it, guys. Real plain, real simple. Beach Cruiser Rim Wheel. Excuse me. And I want you to never fear. The Bike Man for You is here.